a siren. Uh, if that's why they're picking it. So it does make me think they want to fight uh, to some extent with the hero, but it's also not going to be great for Axie engaging into Jumail. Gets a rune now as well, doesn't even need to bottle Crow. Oh. And Zai still level one. They're going for this kill, it looks oh like. Oh my god, he has no surge, no way of making it out, and that is it. It's going to be the sole assumption coming out from Owie. Control, huge objectives, and pressure on enemy team. I think like some draw rangers might just sit in the lane. Oh no, S4. Oh, are they gonna get S4 on the side here? Your Viper dishes out his Viper strike, but he's not gonna be taking anyone with them. Pop of the mech comes out from S4. Universe will end up going down. They get the grave up preemptively for S4. He's fine for now. A one for one trade. S4 will end up going down, making it a two for one in favor of EG. But hey. And they can farm both jungles, whereas Secret has a long time to retreat. Oh, so nice and tanky. All the bonus yep. armor coming out. You've got Weave. You've got Medallion, I believe, on Puppy now as well. Now he is going to get focused. Does have that Aegis, so even if he's brought down, he'll come back. But meanwhile, they're going to make the go into Kuroki, but the Shadow Grave's going to save him out. That doesn't mean Puppy's going to be good, so he goes down. And it's a double kill for Fear. As they jump up to the high ground here, Secret in a bit of trouble. Now that's the Aegis from Arteezy. Wall's going to be committed to make him get caught as they jump up to the high ground here. Arteezy has nowhere to run and nowhere to hide. The Split Earth locking him in place. A triple kill for Fear. Now this is... One of the best fights you could ask for from EG to lead to Rax and then a fallback towards the Roche, but the jump in comes from Universe onto Puppy, bumps him towards the base, and a Death War coming out from PPE. Annihilates with the Split Earth on top of it. Double kill for Sumail, double kill for Fear, and quick. This ward, they have to be in position like right now, yeah. though. It, yes. it dies so They're quickly. Too far, I think. They're too far. Maybe with the birds. They Actually, got, Seeker gonna uh, slows them down. The rockets there. They are beelining it towards this pit, but Roche is already falling past the halfway mark here. He's gonna die way too fast. And Seeker are going to grab this, but they do move in. Vacuum catches them on the way in, and they have to go through that wall. But the jump in from Universe, they're still gonna be able to grab it, and it might be too late for EG as S4 gets the double. They're looking to back off in a way, but there's nowhere really to go unless it's through the wall. But Secret S4, he's gonna get pipped alive. It's Sue Mail. Fires on forward, Owie on the backhand side. They are going to finish up as for Zai, though the pressure coming out from Owie. PL is away so from strong. Them. They cannot yeah. deal with the PL. Fear is just chomping on Owie through the rest. And Fear are just crushing. That's it. And with that, out, uh, Arteezy will come back, but he has nowhere to go. Fear just surrounds his army, and Drow has no answer. A five man takedown. A good, at the expense of a good gamble by Secret. I, Weak to do anything on his own. Bonson split push. Kuro gets scouted out here by Rocket Flare, and I believe maybe spotted playing the ward, although Lestrak is charging forward and he's a running. P what's what is Fear up to? He's coming. Oh in wow. From downtown, they're gonna be able to get the catch this one onto S4. Meanwhile, Sumail doing his own solo work on Desire is gonna be forced to surge away. Now Universe does go down in his one-on-one -on -one matchup with S4. Sumail couldn't finish his target, but now he looks to turn back onto Kuro as Fear is there to help him out. He makes the charge onto Puppy, then makes the immediate jump over to S4, who will will be able to skate the way. Ends up being a two for two trade here. From the time Roshan was about to respawn, they really oh, prioritized man. using these. Puppy, gonna get caught out. Immediate Yules to fly from Sumail. Universe gonna make the jump onto Kuro. Puppy goes down immediately. The swap back, but that puts him closer to danger. And in the both supports, Will go. He falls pretty dang fast. Fears on the way with company. And it looks like Secret are not going to be able to stop him from it. I like how EG hasn't been, really been giving them any opportunities to come back. Because Sphere is there, he can keep track of the darks here. The only way they win this fight is like a vacuum onto the high ground with a wall and they just pummel themselves in the wall. But if darks here has to defend, there's no chance they can win that fight. All right, well, they give the Aegis actually to Sumail. The cheese for now is going to be held over to Universe. Secret, this is, though. This is like the last effort. If oh, they lose man. this fight, it is could be over. Yeah. It could be the beginning of the end, let's say. But for now, they're looking to fight. They run right into Aoi here. Can they focus him down? Universe comes in from behind and catches out Kuroki. Now, Aoi will go down. He's going to be forced to buy back here. Big vacuum from Zai pulls him right into the wall, or Universe will force after the high ground to make himself away here. But Fear, or he locked onto his target, trying to go for Arteezy, who is going to get graved up, survives for now. And with that, will end up potentially going down. He's dropped. And with that, double kill for Fear. He's cleaning out the rest. S4, one of the last survivor is going to be dropped and it looks like they're not going to get the fight they wanted they go into trouble they have really long shots but they're making the right plays 
and taking the only ways that they can to uh, to play the victory. And they just sit passively away for the high ground push, they just instantly lose yeah. with uh, like even lower chance of success. So it may look like they're making suicidal plays, but oh, it's, it's the only option. That's yeah. that's like Dr Dr Ranger lineups in a nutshell. At this point in the game, you just have to make some YOLO, YOLO decisions. Later, Split Puppy. Earth and Puppy. Oh, for the grave. And just get off the shallow grave. <laughs> Please take me back home. Not happening, puppy. He gets put to sleep, and with that, EG final. So now, last resort. Yeah, this split is yellow. Push. Oh, yeah. I know what you're team. doing. Scouts him out, and now Artizi has to man up or not. He will BKB and try to make it away, but Universe says, oh, "Nope, not happening, my old teammate and friend." You're not going anywhere. <laughs> At this point, that just like AFK takes me. This is secret just discussing game two. I feel like they're probably recognizing this is close to over. They're going to take one last hurrah in the bottom lane. Fear, though, just cannot be dealt with. Even with the less track TPing home, secret cannot take this fight. Wow, you can search BKB units. That's cool. I didn't know that. It was one of the buffs, I think, a couple of patches ago, maybe like 6.83 or... Was it 6.84 even? But yeah, we're seeing EG now in complete control. Man, those 36 second BOTs. Or 35, whatever it is. Oh yeah, Octary Core plus the 40 second yeah. original cooldown. That's pretty swell. I was like, man, he's, he's back yeah. there, mighty fast. I was like, I was like did he oh, run man. back? <laughs> All right. Puppy dropped one by one, they go. I mean, at this point, Secret could already be thinking about game number two, yeah. but it is Absolutely. already EG to take game number one of this First match, they're looking pretty damn good. They withstand the initial onslaught from the Drow lineup from Secret. And eventually they just get so many items. They get so big and bad and beefy that the single target damage coming up from the Viper and the Drow is just not enough. I think their their off lane really needed to work. I, I don't know if a different hero would have done a lot more, but it seems that they just needed more efforts into that area of the map because that lost them a couple of pushes and eventually the game.